So, Lee, another win there in pre-season, a different kind of test against Brighton under-23s. What did you take away from that one? Yeah, I was very pleased with our uh, reaction. I thought our shape was good um, out, out of possession. Uh, we worked on that in training and uh, nullified them, really. And the one chance they got um, in the first half, they scored with it. But I thought we, we dominated, really, without being too... Um, too much threatening in the final third. We needed a bit better quality and a bit more relaxed in the final third. But yeah, a, a fantastic game for us. At half time, we made um, a few adjustments and uh, yeah, we scored a couple of goals off the back of that. So really pleasing for the attitude and the the, uh, the shape of the team was was pleasing. It was a lightning fast start from ourselves in both halves, I think it's fair to say. But we had that, but then we went a goal behind and then we had to, towards the end of the game, trade spells of possession. Did it have everything you needed, really, for a pre-season test? I think so. Listen, they're a Premier League Category 1 um, Premiership team, so it's always going to be tough. Yeah, they're under 23s, but listen, they're, they're top players. And uh, I think that gives them a different challenge to what they face week in and week out in, in their games, like it does us. You know, they're a high possession-based team, which... Are well drilled, and have been since ten years old. A lot, a lot of them. Um, so, yeah, different, different sort of proposition for us. But I thought we dealt with it well, and tactically we we got it spot on and managed to come away with a win. Going forward, it was two goals in two minutes in the second half for ourselves. Two different goals as well. A set piece with Aaron Martin, mm. and a, some good high up possession play from ourselves to, to win the ball back and Tristan score it. Yeah, well, you know, I think what I've added to the team this year is is you know a bit of size, and they've got four or five players at 6-2, six, 6-3 six, and over. And uh, so it causes a threat and uh, Aaron Martin pops up. Great ball in from Corey. He's got fantastic um, balls in the box and, and delivery. Uh, and, you know, it's a tough one because he's got great delivery, but at the same time he can score a goal as well because he's aggressive for his, for his size. And, and um, But again, I thought Corey, new sign-in, was fantastic today. Um, and as a team, we looked looked good today. I was really impressed with how we reacted to um, the going behind, 1-0 behind and uh, yeah, pleasing day. Yeah, another highlight was two of our youngsters from the new EDS group mm. came in, Kaya and Oscar, both got minutes and would it be fair to say both impressed? I've been very impressed with those two. You know, um, Oscar's trained with us a few times, uh, Kaya's come in and, and trained a few times. Oscar came away to Devon with us, you know, acquitted himself very, very well. Um, Athletic Oscar wants to run. He's fit. He's sharp. He's uh, got good quality, and and Kai's got good quality. You know, he, he looks like he's um, travels over the ground very well. He's got good quality when he gets on the ball. And he came in today and he didn't look out of place at all. So yeah, very um, very pleased with those two. And at yet such a young age to be chucked into a, a game like that, it, it shows um, that they're mature beyond their years. The only potential downside is obviously Jake Heskett's yeah. injury in the first half. Do we know anything more on that just yet? Yeah, it was a bit of a nasty one. He's landed as he's gone to tackle. He's landed with his feet um, in between the lad and he's come right down his shins. He's got a couple of terrible scrazes down right down his shins and he's gone over on his ankle. He's gone for an x-ray um, on his ankle. So, uh, God willing, he's OK. And then lastly, it's straight back to it on Tuesday against Southampton B. Would that be a similar test, you reckon, as today was? Yeah, again, another Prem, Premier League Category 1 um, under 23s team. So, be similar, I'd imagine. Um, might be a possibility of a couple of first team lads playing because I think they had a game today and they haven't got one Tuesday. So, you'd think that they would add a couple that didn't get enough game time uh, with it being on the doorstep and the pitch being so good. Uh, I think that could be um, one where we could have uh, an even tougher test than today. Perfect. Cheers, Lee. Thank you. Cheers.